What hidden treasures will we find on this pallet? We have no idea. Hang on, on for the loop! Loop! Four, three, two, one. I'm Ricky. And I'm Jamie. It feels so good to be back. I know, I miss these chairs. Let's give them a spin. <laughs> Sliding to the left, and just we're back. like always. Mm. Ricky, why do you think the Loop Show is here? Like, why does it exist? Like, what's its purpose? Yes, I think we need a purpose statement. Mm. How about Loop Show is here to make you eat gross stuff? Ah, or it's here to take up space on the internet. Uh, ooh, how about the Loop Show is here because we trained 11 otters how to write and this is what they wrote. Oh, that's really cute. <gasps> what about the Loop Show isn't here and this is all a simulation? Yeah. I know. Okay, I feel like those are good, but they're not quite saying what we're trying to say. What are we trying to say? Well, I want everybody watching to know that they are here for a reason and that we are here for a reason. That's a good starting point. Let's start there. So when I was in middle school, I was tiny. Like I was so much smaller than anyone else my age. And not only was I like smaller, but I also looked younger. In fact, um, I have a younger sister. Her name is Abby and we're three years apart. And by the time I hit middle school, nobody could really tell who was older. Oh, are you guys like oh, twins? Oh, no. Well, who's older? And I remember like looking at myself and looking at everyone else and kind of feeling insignificant. Like to the point where sometimes I, I kind of question like, do, do I matter? So what about you? Have you ever felt like a tiny speck on a great big earth? Like, have you ever asked those questions of, do I, do I matter? Maybe you've looked up at the sky and you've asked God like, do I even have a purpose? And I wanna tell you that those are all really great questions. And they're questions that our big God can handle. Because you see, when God created the earth, he specifically made human beings. And because he is loving and because he is generous and good, he gave them the gift. And this gift is the gift of life. Meaning that this gift in its own, because it comes from God, has worth. Meaning that just by being alive, you have value. You have worth. Meaning that you weren't made in some cosmic accident. It's not by random or chance that you are here or you are who you are. No, you have been made by God and so has everyone else with worth, with value. You have purpose. So the Loop Show got this giant pallet of stuff and we have no idea what's inside it. So we're unboxing to see if we find anything good. All right, before you go, yes? what do you think it is? Oh, uh, the Marshmallow Man. Uh, just in different boxes, okay. Oh, uh, well I was thinking it is actually one big box and he's just finagled in there. Oh, like a magic trick. Yes. I <laughs> think that this is just gonna be a bunch of expired shrimp chips. Ew. All right, let's dive in, Yay! okay? Yay, okay. I can't decide which tool to use. Okay. Uh, whoa, that kind of oh, scared I me. I dug Are we allowed to like? Boop, boop, boop. So far, I do not see the marshmallow man. Oh, 
Get ready, Davey. Yes? It's about to get lit. It's a lampshade. Oh, I like it. We have, it's a lampshade. It's really nice. Buckle up. The fun doesn't stop there. Oh, oh, what time is it? JB, uh, what time is it? time. No, no, I think this clock is broken. What time is it? Oh, hey, hey, hey. Air hockey. Oh, that's awesome. Or hover hockey. What else we got? This mirror. Oh, wow. Who can you see in this mirror? It's Ricky. How do I look with my clock? <laughs> Oh, perfect, the clock and Ricky. Yeah. I like it. Oh, look at this. Shrimp chips, shrimp chips. That's surprisingly hard to say. Nothing. Nothing. Well, yay, another gold mirror. I feel like it's Christmas day whenever you're supposed to pretend like you really like the gift. Oh. Yay, thank you, Aunt Darlene. <laughs> thank you. Lamps. I'm wondering, are we getting a new Loop Show set and that's what we're unveiling? Congratulations, <laughs> you get to make over the set. Today is hosted by the letter H. What it, words can you think of, Ricky, that start with the letter H? Hollandaise sauce. House. Oh, look at this. Oh, wow, it's a four-in-one camper. A four-in-one glamper. Oh, glamper. <laughs> this is really awesome. Uh, oh, you that is a full-on table. Like, I know. <laughs> Oh, Jamie. What? <laughs> oh, you're not going to believe this. Wow. Look at this. Oh, that's cool. It's a remote control Batmobile. Oh, what do you know about Batman, Ricky? I'm so glad you asked. So I want to say in 1936 is one of the first mm -hmm. issues that Batman first appeared in, in Detective Comics. That's what the DC stands for in DC Comics. Detective. Wait. So a lot of the Batman's early adventures weren't like super superhero -y stuff, because I mean, he's a detective. That's the main thing, just solving mysteries like they did. And that ends the golden age. So now entering the- Oh, hey, there's more boxes to open. Oh, you're absolutely right. I never would have expected us to find something like this. So now that you've uncovered what's on this pallet, see if you can determine what it's worth. Guess the value of the pallet. The closest to the price gets to pick one item to take home. Oh, Woohoo! Okay. I'm in. All right, let's see. Uh, all right. All right, I'm guessing my lucky number, but two of them. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So guessing on what all these things are valued at. Well, how many of them are broken or, I'm sorry, I'm not gonna help you. I wanna win. <laughs> okay, all right. One, and two, three. Money or less. No, money or $113. And oh. uh, five nine four three two cent. I guessed uh, fifty five dollars and fifty five cents with a smiley face and a heart. Ooh, but what's the value of the smiley face and the heart? Uh, maybe add a penny for each. So I'm guessing fifty five dollars and fifty seven cents. Okay. The palette is valued at one thousand one hundred and fifty eight dollars. Wait a second. But is that before it was returned? The, the, they sell the palette as is. I lost by a lot. <laughs> and I won by not much more. <laughs> I gotta take one thing home. What oh. are you gonna take home, Ricky? Oh, You're man. gonna take the right. That's just. Of course. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the Batmobile, which originally wasn't part of Batman's whole uh, getup. The Batmobile wasn't even introduced until like the mid 40s. And uh, I'm, I'm really excited. This stuff was worth a lot more than I thought it was. And speaking of worth, God gave each one of us worth. And he gave us a calling to live a holy life. That was his plan Before there was time Before the beginning of time To show us grace in Jesus Christ For God saved us And he called us To live a holy life Before there was time For God saved me And he called me To live a holy life 